All right, scientists, I can't wait to see what kinds of observations you made when you used your lungs. <gasps> Sid, may we take a look at your journal? Oh, sure. Um, well, it was easy to blow bubbles in the water. I went, and then I tried to make the pinwheel spin. And I had to breathe a lot of air into my lungs and exhale a lot to make it spin fast. But I did it. Oh, your lungs worked hard. Good job, Sid. Thank you. Okay, May. Let's look at your journal. Okay. Um, I blew lots of soapy bubbles, and I had to blow really slowly to make a big bubble. <laughs> As you exhaled more and more, the bubble got bigger and bigger. Yes. <laughs> now I know another way you can all use your lungs. How? You can all go and play with all your new ideas. Yeah! yeah. It's time for... Good Laughter <laughs> Knock, knock. Who's there? Lung. Lung who? It's been a long time since I've seen you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Sid. Yes, Gerald. Well, what did one lung say to the other lung? Mm, I don't know what. Breathe you later. <laughs> Oh, wait. Hey, wait. I have another one. Okay. Okay, what What do lungs wear under their pants? Mm, I don't know. What? Lungderwear. <laughs> hey, May. Yes, Gabriella? Why do the ox like to breathe? I don't know. Why? Because he liked oxygen. <laughs> uh, why did the fox like to breathe? I don't know. Why? Because he liked foxygen. <laughs> now that's funny. Watch more on your local PBS station and the PBS Kids video app.